kind of your role in this offense? Are you going to be the big play guy, the, the third down guy, or, or just do it all? I say just the ultimate teammate, whatever the team needs, really. Do you, I mean, what does that look like in camp and in yeah, the scrimmage so, so far? Um, I'm not the most vocal person, but the coaches have really been trying to get me to like uh, step up and because they realized they told me that I'm leading by example, but now like be more vocal and they see that I encourage guys, but just help the younger guys because um, I remember being a young guy as well, and when an older guy came to me and I really respected that, you know, so just helping up. What's it been like getting Jacquez and Brennan in here this summer? Well, I hang out with Brendan all the time, and uh, Jack Quest, he's funny, so we all get along pretty well. Um, it's funny because they were both stressing over the playbook, and as I was too when I got here in the spring, and I was just telling them, like, just view it bit by bit every day, and soon you tie into, like, oh, this goes with this. This is the same play, but the slot has some different, you know? So it's just, just being uh, not stressing out about it and just knowing that with time it'll come. How would you compare where you are now versus where you were in the spring? Definitely a lot more smart and uh, just comfortable. That's what I would say. Like I was telling you, Coach Jones really has um, challenged the receivers to learn more about like coverages and just knowing football opposed to, oh, I play outside of our receiver, you know? Being more versatile and then being able to know what the defender's going to do before it actually happens. Brennan mentioned that uh, you guys like to go fishing together. Who catches yeah. the biggest fish usually? I've only went with him a couple of times, and when I went, he didn't catch anything. But we're not going to say that, but yeah, so yeah. But he's a good fisherman, though. He was showing me some pictures of the stuff he's got, and it's huge. Nice. Yeah. I know you maybe didn't play as much as you wanted to at Michigan, but how much does it help just being in a program that you know was in the playoffs and had that kind of big game experience? Yeah, so I feel like that really helped, um, how does I say it? That really set the standard of where I want to be at every year. And the coaches and the players, they really emphasize that, yeah, we want to win the Big Ten or the uh, Big 12, sorry. And we want to go to the playoffs. And just me knowing how good that feels to be in Miami, to be like in that situation, it's amazing. And to be able to compete for, like to go to the national championship, I want to do that every year. So that's why I'm here. Andrea, you had a great spring. Have you been able to pick it up in this training camp where you left off with spring? Yeah, I've been working a lot in the off season. I really feel like, just like I said earlier, just being comfortable has my, been my main emphasis. Being more comfortable and just understanding why I'm doing something opposed to, oh, I'm just running this route just because, you know? And like I was saying as well, um, Coach Jones really emphasizes how just knowing in certain looks, maybe it might not be your ball, get your brother open. So. Yeah. Have you become, are you becoming more of a complete receiver? Everybody knows about your speed, your ability to go deep. You've always said, I want to become more a complete sir. receiver. Is that goal I'm coming to Yes, sir. It, for you? It's in progress. Yes, sir. Definitely huh? some improvement there. Coach Jones was telling us a couple weeks ago, he, he doesn't like to classify guys as inside receivers or outside yes. receivers. Yes, he hates that. Is, is that different than you know how it was for you at Michigan, maybe? Um, I'm trying to think. They really try to make us be more versatile as well, so he just really harps on it all the time. So. Have you worked at both spots? A little bit, yeah. Yes, sir. How has that relationship and chemistry with uh, mm -hmm. Dylan progressed this fall? It's definitely progressed a lot over the summer. Um, just those, uh, what do we call it, uh, player leads, like mm -hmm. those workouts and just we'll do stuff on the weekends after practice. And it's just the timing and all that is really coming together right now. How do you feel the wide receiver core is coming along? Uh, it's going to be special. Like that's. I'm excited about everybody in the room because I've, since I've been here, I've seen the growth that everybody's had, and it's like, wow. So I know we're going to be special. Anyone in particular catch your eye these first ten practices? I mean, everybody has did something to a point like I'm like, damn, like you know, like that's nice. <laughs> what up, bro? But yeah, everybody. I mean, from just quick game like uh, twitchy to deep routes to like dunking on somebody's head like it's all like it, we all play a role and that's why I like this because we all specialize and we all can take something from one another.